So we're going to Antigua next week. I'm so excited. But I get asked all the time, like, what to pack, what to bring. I don't know what to wear to the all-inclusive resorts. So I'm not going to do a packing video every single time, but I usually do buy a bunch of things. So I'm happy to take a couple minutes and just show what I bought, and then maybe that will be helpful to you when you're deciding what to wear or what to pack. So I got a maxi dress from Ross. And this was like $11.99. And I got my husband a polo shirt from Costco. This was $19.99. And where we're going, so we're going to Hammock Cove in Antigua. And there's really only one like main fancy restaurant. And my husband will need to wear um, pants and a collared shirt every time we're in there and we plan to eat there every night and then I got another maxi dress from a boutique in South Carolina and I think this was $68 another button-up shirt for my husband this was from TJ Maxx $14.99 Another shirt from Costco. I think this was on sale. I think it was $11.99, I think. I know I got two that day. They were both $11.99. Let's see. And then I got another maxi dress. And when I first saw it, I was like, oh, is that going to be too fancy? And then I tried it on, and I still thought it was going to be a little fancy, which I still think it's fancy. But one night during the week there's a seven course dinner and that's like the fanciest meal so i figured i would rather be overdressed than underdressed and i don't know where the tag is on this but oh it's over here 14.99 and then i didn't know what i wanted to wear on the plane i got some new linen pants from tj maxx i'm gonna wear these on the plane these were 19.99 Plane travel, it depends like where we're going and how long the flight is because sometimes I go and I try to look nice and then other times I just look like completely homeless. And we have a non-stop flight so it's only like four-ish hours or something and I just feel like I can go not looking so homeless. And then um, I got this carry-on luggage. Technically this is not new because I used it last month but I never showed you guys it. So this is Cool Life Luggage. It's linked in my Amazon storefront. I'll put it in the video's description if you're looking for like a carry-on brand that is a little bit cheaper. I actually really like it. Um, it's smaller than my Away. It's like two inches smaller, um, but I was able to get everything in it last month I needed to, so I'm happy with it. And then I got my husband just a new shirt for the pool. This was from Target and it was $12. And a bathing suit for my husband. This was also from Costco. Can you tell we like Costco? I think this was $9.99 on sale. And then I got from Target this. These are um, bathing suit like cover up bottoms. And I think for this trip for the black, I am going to use it as a cover up, but I have a colorful print that I've actually worn to dinner before. And I love it. They're not see-through. They're really comfortable. I actually have them over here. So again, I guess this would be another thing that's not new. I wore them last month, but I never did like a full length shot. So no one ever saw them. So I'm going to pack them and probably wear them again this trip. But so they're the same pants. Those are black. This was just colorful and Target and they were $19.99. Um, really like them. And then I got a bathing suit from Costco, and I think this was $20. And I got another bathing suit from Somersault. This was, I think, $116, I think. Um, I have a couple of these. I think this is my third style, like third pattern, and I really like them. They're super comfortable, and I think that they're worth 
spending a little bit extra money on bathing suits that you like. And then, of course, I just had to get like sunscreens, and so I always get them from Target because I just do carry-on onlys. So I get a couple. Um, so this is like 1.8 ounces and three ounces, and I don't know the price on this. I think this was like 2.19. They used to be much less than they are now, but what are you gonna do? And then I got a Lumi Glotion. I like to put this like as makeup. I like to wear this. Um, at night. Um, this is linked to my Amazon storefront. I like this a lot. Candies. Candies for the treat bags. I get this from Costco. I also have it in my Amazon storefront. So if Costco's out, then I get it on Amazon. A bag like this will last me maybe three vacations. And if you're not familiar with what I do with the candy, I put them in little bags and then add in tip money as a thank you to the staff. Um, just something a little extra to let them know that they're really appreciated. And it goes over really well. I have so many clients that do this now and I always get messages being like, you are so right, they loved it. So if you have a little extra room in your luggage, bringing like a little candy treat is really appreciated. And then liquid IV. So we take this twice a day, morning and night. And I got new flavors this time, golden cherry and wild berry blend. Typically, I like to just stick with passion fruit because that's my favorite, but I'm really trying to branch out, so new flavors. And then last but not least, I got a raft for the pool. We have like a little private pool in our villa, and I thought that the uh, this one would be really good. So I got this from Five Below, so it was $5.00. They don't carry, at least at my store, because I live in Connecticut where it's only warm for a few months. So they don't carry these things year round. So I also get them on Amazon or at Target. Um, and I like these a lot. I don't take them back home with me. I just leave it, give it to someone else because for $5, I don't want to take it back with me. And then I also just this morning got some new hats. Obviously I didn't get them yet because I just ordered it, but I'll put in a picture of what they look like and um, I got them from Hemlock. I'll link that in the video's description as well. And I think that's it. So we leave, I'm filming this video and we're gonna leave, I think, I think it's either nine or 10 days from today. So there is a possibility that I could buy a couple more things. I don't really know, but for outfit wise, we have all the outfits picked out. So I'm not gonna be buying anything major. It'll probably just be like small stuff that you really don't care about. So I hope this was helpful to you and we will see you really soon in Antigua.